Welcome everyone, we have another fantastic vehicle here for you. We have a 2013 Ford Taurus. Let's go ahead and do this quick walk around, point out all the perfections, but also point out all the perks. Off the top, beautiful HID headlights. You have LED fog lights, which is really nice. These LED lights here run across, and it gives you a real nice bright white look in those blind spots where the fog lights are, uh, are predominantly used for. So that's great. I love the chrome trim. Wheels and tires are in great shape. Do you see a little scratch mark right here? A little rock chip right there. Do you have the backup sensors? It is the SEL with the flex fuel option. Also, uh, gold out exhaust. Go ahead and pop the trunk here. Love the trunk space in these vehicles. Plenty of room for storage here. All your floor mats, your spare tire with an actual wheel. As you can see, it does say temporary wheel use only, but at least it's a stylish, uh, stylish wheel to begin with. Uh, you do have a, a license plate cover and uh, of course your owner's manual and everything else. Fantastic. Let's keep on trucking, as they say. See, uh, there we go. Just one little scratch right there. Be it. I do want to point out both mirrors, both driver's side and passenger side have this uh, blind spot uh, uh, mirror here as well. And they're all heated, so great for the winter time. Okay? Solid black door panel, beautiful nickel trim, nice leather padding, power windows, power mirrors, power locks, nice cubby space for storage, including a cup holder. Beautiful stitch black leather. Both manual and powered seats. You have uh, powered adjustments here, up and down. Also lumbar and the rear. Okay. All your light settings here. Let's go ahead and jump on in. I must say I really do love the way Ford did their interior. Very nice, very stylish, very modern. Almost like flying a jet. You got this beautiful nickel trim. Um, that seems like it's been uh, kind of buffered out. Really cool look. You got a center sub here, tweeters on the sides, speakers on the doors, plenty of good sound. Of course, you can see you have a digital display here for your radio, AC, and the works. Let's go ahead and give this a jump. I'll give you guys a quick view of how the dash operates. You have two digital screens on each side here. On your left side here, you see these these are two little toggles this toggle right here operates everything on the left screen this little toggle here operates everything on the right screen this one does your onboard computer so any settings that you want to do with your onboard computer is right off of this on the left side of your steering wheel also carries your cruise control settings nice beautiful nickel trim on the right you have all your media control settings and this toggle operates everything that has to do with your radio off of that little screen right there as you can see I have 97.5 Oop, 97, oh, I'm sorry, 95.7 on the, on the screen there, so that's great. This beauty only has, let's see if I can get that. There we go, 666,015 miles. I'm so sorry, I said that so incorrectly. 66,615 miles, much better. Excellent. Here on the center screen, on your, on your center dash here, you have your radio and AC controls. Everything is touchscreen here. Heated seats for both driver and passenger. Okay, you do have a compass on the top. The compass is not navigation, but it does help you out. Of course, you have Bluetooth because this vehicle is powered by Microsoft Sync. All of these little functions here are by touch only. You only need to touch the item and it would actually uh, initiate the, uh, the sequence that you're looking for. Temperature control is here, your AC if you will. It is dualed out, so individual temperature control for both driver and passenger. Here at the bottom, you have a nice little cubby space for storage, including a power source. 
You have your shifter here. Next to the shifter, you have a cup holder. You have the shifter surrounded in nice black leather and chrome trim. You have sport mode here, which allows you to shift your own gears. You have the little toggles right there next to the shifter. Here on a, on a back end, you have another, another um, storage compartment. You can go to Ford and buy these little dividers here, and you can use this as a cup holder or whatever it may be. And like I said, it is powered by Microsoft Sync, which allows you to program your phone to the vehicle, and it gives you a few more additional options. Here you have a nice storage compartment. Uh, you have an SD card slot. You have USB and you have two USB connections here, so that's great. You have a nice power source here. And you have an AVI setup, which gives you video, audio, and the works for a, any common household DVD player, whatever it may be that you want to actually set up with video and audio. Very nice. All right, up top, sunglass holders. And that should do it. Fantastic. Let's go ahead and... uh check out the rest of the vehicle and let's see what else we got working on <coughs> same door panel design solid black you have the black leather padding nickel trim power windows cubby space for storage including a cup holder nanny for storage nice stitched leather here on the center armrest you have two cup holders in the rear you have rear AC and power source On the other side here, we have the same door panel design, solid black with black leather padding, nickel trim. We do have power windows, cubby space for storage, including a cup holder, another one with netting as well. And give you guys a nice close up of these seats. Now, although these seats do look thick, as you can see, you could always bring these down and attain a little bit more room for the back end, which I don't think you ever need to do that. But that's something that is definitely a plus. Excellent. Front door panel design, solid black, nickel trim, power windows, power locks, cubby space for storage including a cup holder, nice leather stitching, manual and powered seat. You have powered adjustments here, manual here, here, and that should do it. Here in the glove compartment you have another owner's manual, as you can see and plenty of storage space. Fantastic. All right, folks, if you are interested in this beautiful 2013 Ford Taurus, please contact one of my sales consultants at 281-955-6555, or you can view 50 additional pictures and Carfax report at www.epicautosalestx.com. Thank you.